Yeah, so just looking at a full system replacement. Um, it's a split level house and all the equipment's inside this utility room. I'm about to go in, you can see the grill. That's cut in. It's a high efficiency furnace. Got the, got the two three inch pipes that are running out. Um, so we're gonna use those. We're gonna do the water heater at the same time. We've got a five inch uh, flue coming down. Looks like it's got aluminum at the moment. So I'll basically just wipe pretty much everything out on the water heater apart from the flue pipe coming down. Um, we've got good room to come back with a 40 gallon water heater. Let's make a note of that. Um, as far as the furnace is concerned, it's actually a C width at the moment. We might be able to come back with a, a B width and give ourselves a little bit more room. I'm going to have a good look at that. Uh, we're going to tidy up this whole um, filter situation so I've got a measure for a new return drop shape from the angle here that was actually a 20 yeah it's a 22 inch um, return drop at the moment so yeah with the flue pipes um, coming down there's a reason why they did that. So there's a humidifier we'll replace at the same time. Drains close by. Shut off for the gas. The line set is just running around and making its way out to the other side. So it's a real short run. It's probably less than 15 feet by the time it drops down. So we'll replace the line set new filter, we'll go with the wide filter. We've got some room here, this is just some um, temporary shelving that will come out of the way. And then we'll just probably have to do it, maybe do a little offset just to give ourselves a little bit more room uh, to put in that filter. Uh, that's pretty much it. Um, the, the electric panels in the garage, we can shut that off. So. That's it, it's gonna be a full system um, with the water heater at the same time, that's it.